Hey, good morning. I wanted to share with you a couple of things I've been thinking about recently. Maybe you can tell I'm on a rebounder. Um, I want to talk about the power of letting go and also the power of oxygen. So first of all, my friend John has this rebounder out on his patio and because he was in this car crash and he's been having some trouble with his knees, he couldn't use it anymore. And, and he just said, do you want it? And I thought, what a cool thing because you know, every time he looked at the rebounder, he probably had this kind of dip in energy like, oh, I can't use that anymore. And now that I have it, I'm always sending him, not always, but most of the time when I get on this, I send him really good thoughts because I thought, what a cool thing. You know, now I'm getting some use out of it and things are circulating in both of our lives. And it does relate to food because, you know, I used to have packaged food. I would just buy stuff and keep it in my cabinet and it wasn't circulating and it's like money it's like air it's like food it's like everything it's like the more we keep it circulating the better for everybody and so with this rebounder now in the morning I open up my window wide open first thing in the morning and the air is so crisp and so clean it's just like I just drink it in it's amazing and I get high off it, really, because the air is just, well, I wish you could smell it. It's just so good. And the point is that I live in the small town, 6,600 people at Squim, Washington. And I was downtown the other day, and I was behind this truck, and the fumes got into my car, and I was just like, oh, my gosh. It was so horrible. The contrast between crisp, fresh morning air and that air it was just it was just so striking to me and I started thinking about food and how if people are on the sad diet they don't necessarily know how bad it is until they get really fresh live colorful enzyme rich foods in their diet because now if I go back to that stuff it just it's not even like food to me so so bottom line is <laughs> I'm loving my rebounder <laughs> and if you have anything in your house that you're not using that maybe somebody else could use, I encourage you to bless it and pass it along to somebody else.